We continue our celebration of Hispanic Heritage Month here at WGN by taking you to Pilsen and a new program that's introducing students to the arts. As WGN's Lourdes Duarte found out, it's one of the many ways an entire community has remained engaged during this pandemic. Step inside the Pilsen Food Pantry, where new tunes are taking shape in one of Chicago's largest Latinx communities in the city. We started a week before COVID. And it's been an interesting year and a half. While the food pantry's known for helping families cope with hunger, Daniel Chavez and his wife Catrice are adding another dimension to that building. With a background in education and dance, they created the People's Center for Cultural and Contemporary Arts, offering courses in music, dance, and photography to children starving for more arts programming. There's not a lot of jazz education in Pilsen, um, so that's something that we're you know, trying to fill that gap. And although challenging during the pandemic, it seems to be working for a community that is so rich in culture. Pilsen is full of amazing, beautiful murals and artwork, but it's also full of everyday life. 15-year-old Bianca Mendoza gravitated not toward the music classes, but photography. She first learned about it through her mother. Honestly, I was kind of eh about it because whenever she recommended me stuff, I didn't really have that much fun doing it. This has been different, though. She says it exposed her to a brand new way of looking at things. She's not necessarily thinking it's a career. But it's definitely something I would do for, like, to calm down after... I've been really stressed out. It's those stories that energize everyone involved in getting the programs off the ground. We have some really wonderful conversations around how their worldviews and what's impacting them that maybe I forgot about. From pictures. I'm really impressed with the progress in their work. To instruments. The work the students create and learn about is growing every day. I think it's important to, to teach our children some of the culture that, that was founded here. Because um, jazz is a beautiful thing. It, it's literally a mix of, of people and cultures that were able to come together and collaborate to create this music. The plan is to continue inspiring students regardless of the location. Today it's a food pantry, but tomorrow may bring brand new opportunities for a community that has always loved the arts. Long term, we would love to have our own center um, and be able to, you know, have all the different art forms and also extend it out not only in the post community but all around the world you know one day and the Pilsen food pantry is just one of the partners but there are others throughout the city like the resurrection project and the Chicago Park District so you will find the classes at other locations as well there is a small fee to enroll under ten dollars in many cases we're gonna post a link to the program on our website WGNTV.com I'm Lourdes Duarte WGN News